remember that next time. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, I think it was. <laughs> I wasn't really counting. I was just kind of just playing the game as it went on. But I'm glad I could help the team any way that I can. You seem to be on one today, though. Like, was it the Wheaties? You know, what what, what happened? That's God. There's nothing but God. My teammates, they, they put me in a great position. The coach is making some great calls that opened it up for me. You know, I'm glad we got the win. I'm glad I can contribute. When you're looking at a game plan and you're looking at Louisville, were, were you kind of mentally prepared for this? Like you thought this was a game you might be able to tee off of it? I mean, I do that for every game. You know, I just, I try to be the a star player in every game. Uh, today worked out in my favor, I guess. I'm glad we got the win. Uh, my teammates they opened everything up for me, so I'm glad I can contribute. As a team, uh, coming off of that Notre Dame loss, what was the mentality like this week as you guys prepared and got set to take the field today? Yeah, the worry was just respond the whole week, just respond. Uh, whatever that looked like, respond, be more physical. I think we did that tonight, but you know, we they prided us in just responding from the loss, and uh, we did that tonight. I'm glad we got the win. We How big was it for you to, with, with Trenton not playing, to come out there and, and play the way you did? And you guys kind of set the tone there early in that first quarter. Yeah, for sure. You know, it, I hate that Trent's out, but, you know, uh, next man up mentality. So we just had to step up, uh, move some guys around, and, uh, you know, just we did it for him. You know, he's hurt. So we just we tried to just pick him up and just, you know, get the win. Barry, can you walk us through that intersection, what you saw and how it just came all, came all together? Yeah, so we practiced that play in practice like so many times. So once I saw the tight end wing set, I knew exactly what was coming. I gave a call to Sheridan, kind of alerted him about it. But no, I knew I knew what was coming. We ran that in practice so much, and uh, it worked out. Barrett, were you watching uh, Shipley's hurdle on that touchdown run, and what did you think? I, I got the hurdle from him. You know? <laughs> the running back kept cutting me the whole game, yeah. so I knew I was kind of setting it up where I could hurdle him, and I worked out, and, and I got the sack. So I'm, yeah. I'm proud. But no, that that play was insane. Yeah, that, that was insane from Shipley. Barrett, do you feel like there's more opportunities for you to be around the ball when you're playing more in the box? I think you there's more opportunities if, like you you make your own opportunity. So wherever you are on the field, as long as you're running to the ball, you know you'll create the opportunities that you want. But no, I don't think any position you know gives you more or less opportunity. I just try to hustle to the ball. Do you feel comfortable playing there? Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. I think I'm pretty natural there. I played that in high school some, so the moving in there it wasn't any big adjustment. Is there a point? Like what as what? Oh, sorry, sorry. This question, but um, he looked comfortable in there today. Yeah. What do you? Playing alongside him, what are his strengths? Yeah, Wade, he busts his tail every day. He's so he's so smart. He understands the game from a guy who just got here in the summer. So, you know, he's very strong. He knows what to do. Very instinctual. So I'm, I'm proud of Wade for sure. Is there a point where you kind of get rolling, where it, it, it feels like your day and those juices are flowing? Yeah, you try not to think about it too much. Dude. You don't want to, like, jinx yourself in a way. But, you know, I saw her making some plays, so I was just like, I just got to keep going. But I try not to jinx myself. Just lean into that yeah. groove. If it, if it happens, it happens. Perfect. Thank you. you. feel like you needed to make some plays with Trenton being out? Is the spotlight was on you to, to make some things happen? Yeah, I think so. You know, Trent, that's a he's a three-year starter for us, so having him out, that was definitely a big loss. So I just I try to step up and just lead, lead the team to a win, and I'm glad I, I got to do that. What was the message from last week coming into this week for when you guys played last week? Respond. You know, we got out physical last week, so just respond. You know, we need to we need to be the dominators. We need to dominate the man in front of us, and we did that tonight. Your last sack had pretty nice hurdles. You gonna have a back and forth with, with Shipley about his hurdles. <laughs> I think mine was a little better. You know, the <laughs> offensive player is probably gonna get more credit, but I'll let him have it. I, I think mine was better. <laughs> Thank you. No more questions. Thanks, guys.